Today let's discuss about Final Fantasy VII for Nintendo Switch and I have here the, this uh, twin pack, uh, the card that will include Final Fantasy VII and Final Fantasy VIII uh, remastered games. Um, the, these games, these, uh, these two games are on a single card and uh, this is great. This is, uh, this is the box, this is how it looks. And uh, today we will discuss in this video about Final Fantasy VII. After that, um, I will post another video with Final Fantasy VIII. So um, I have here my uh, my Switch OLED, and let's see how this game is. As you know by now, in this uh, in this video, I will uh, present the game here with general info from eShop, and after that, the review and a longer uh, part of the video, the third one with, uh, with the gameplay. Also, you can find on my YouTube channel uh, short reviews. Uh, they have uh, four minutes, something like this, uh, less or more, uh, but in general, four minutes. This is the game, this is a uh, description for the game, the price here in, uh, in a shop, and um, the game will have 3.8 gigabytes you can use switch pro controller this and you can play it on tv uh, in tabletop mode with joy con or handheld mode so let's see it here on uh, on switch oled and let's see how it looks i hope i will have um, a good light here and i will not have uh, lines like you like you saw uh, earlier in a shop you know that's happening because of natural light and my leds here with this oled it's a strange story i have two videos in which i explain that anyway this is uh, this is the game and um, you can control the character using your left stick here or you can use the arrows and you can do this slow uh, movements and precise movements and here we go in a battle as you know, this uh, this game was originally released in uh, two thousand um, in uh, sorry in uh, nineteen ninety seven. So it's a it's a long way um, uh, until uh, until now from nineteen ninety seven. And let's attack here. It was uh, originally released for PlayStation One and only for that uh, for that console. But now you can find uh, you can find the game on uh, mobile, on other consoles like PlayStation, PC, and so on. But here on Nintendo Switch, it has its magic. You can play it in. In my opinion, this is the best way to play this game on Nintendo Switch. Either you play it on Switch version two with LCD display, or you play it here on Switch uh, OLED you will have an excellent uh, experience. The game looks great and um, at that time was one, one of the best, if not even the best uh, role-playing game for, uh, on the market. And you know, from 1997, uh, this game uh, survived and uh, aged well. But this is, this is, my, uh, this is my opinion. Now here on Switch, what can I say? It looks great, it feels great, it's well optimized and if you want to experience this, um, this classic game and if you like Final Fantasy Universe, then it's great. I will advise you to, to get it. If you press... Um, If you press settings immediately, by the way, I have the music uh, deactivated. The game has a very beautiful, uh, very beautiful music. If you press the X button, you will enter in this window where you can see your items, magic, 
equipment and you can go to to settings here you can change uh, this window color you can um, you can activate or deactivate the music battle speed battle message the camera angle and that's it so you have some settings here as i was um, as i was saying uh, this game looks fantastic here on switch and uh, i'm glad that we have this uh, this classic game because this is a classic masterpiece maybe you know it maybe you don't anyway um, it's it's a it's a marvelous game what can i say and uh, i don't know if you have the game or if you have this pack uh, write a comment and share with us and um, tell us if you have this game or not if you if you plan to get it what is your experience with it you cannot change this original look you cannot make the game wide and probably i don't know uh, they didn't want to um, to affect the view and the image i don't know to change uh, they probably decided to uh, to offer us this classic view of the game and anyway uh, this is beautiful it doesn't bother me uh, you have a lot uh, a big image here it's it's excellent so uh, the action uh, it's in uh, midgar in this uh, corporation city and you are trying to to destroy this uh, this factory and from here you will have so many adventures the game has has a lot of potential and uh, still now in 2022 it has a lot to offer this is uh, this is my uh, my experience anyway and my opinion I know you can play this on a on a smartphone for example but you know you won't have the same experience that you have here on switch um, we have some games also that are avail available for uh, smartphones they are here available on switch and so on but the experience it's it's different i can tell you this because i have um, i i tried the games on smartphone and also on switch I tried the games on um, on smartphone with uh, with a controller and also on Switch. The experience uh, are different. Here you will have the best and the most enjoyable experience on Switch. I don't know why uh, this. I believe uh, this format, uh, the controllers, the way that you handle the, this device, the screen, the bigger screen, uh, everything it's it's different, and I uh, I like it here i like to play a game here and not on a smartphone this is at least um <clears throat> my my experience i don't know what uh what how you prefer to play if you like to play on a smartphone or if you like to play uh, on switch i don't know also you can share with us um, this fact and now let's try to open these uh, these doors center this huge factory okay let's press this button So if you're asking me to get this pack or not, definitely go for it. It's a, it's a beautiful pack with two games and uh, over time 
this will prove um, fantastic to have the game on a, on a card the games on a card it will be great in the future this is what i like on switch you have the possibility to 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 get the games not only um, uh, from a shop in digital format but format but you can get them also on your card and um, this is fantastic because um, in uh, i don't know 10 years from now this will be a, a great aspect because you will be able to play the games uh, even if the the shop it's uh, it's off or something like this anyway um, what what I uh, what I don't like is the fact that you don't have the possibility to to put the the updates for the game on the card. This would be fantastic. Um, imagine this: in 15 years from now, if you have a classic Switch and you if you have the game but you don't have the update installed on a micro SD card, uh, this won't be good. You won't be able to play the game basically. Um, you will play it, but not with the latest updates and fixes. And um, I think that Nintendo uh, was wrong here with the cards. The, um, the correct way um, they uh, they should give us the possibility to download that update on the card. And every time when you get a game like this with a card and you receive an update, that update should be written written by the, by the the switch on the card this is how i see it uh, correctly and uh, anyway this is my my view i don't know what you think related to this subject but this is how i see everything anyway it's great to to have the games uh, on card and to be able to, to play them anytime. So here you have to press the A button and you will grab that ladder. Go here and we have a battle. By now you are uh, accustomed with the battles. Let's use some magic. Let's see. Big shot. Let's go here and let's see. Use this potion here and again and now we have um, the life bar full you 
you can save the game in points like this one now just enter the menu and press save Let's go here. I know the, the game uh, at this moment without music, it's strange. It, it doesn't have the same beauty, uh, but you know, of, um, because I don't know how the copyrights are for, for the music, I cannot um, activate it here. And uh, anyway, if you, if you play it with, uh, with the music on, the game is fantastic. No way.
Let's see if we can save it. No. Let's run. Let's save it here. Now we have a better weapon. So this is the game anyway, Final Fantasy VII, a beautiful, beautiful game, uh, originally created in 1996 uh, for, uh, for PlayStation 1, and um, sorry, 1997 for PlayStation 1, and uh, now in 2022 this game still looks fantastic. Thanks for watching.